Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Big Boy Bob 111. Um, today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to flash your device. And what that actually enables you to do is use other people's custom ROMs that um, are much better than the stock ROM. They work faster, they work smoother, a le lot less glitches, a lot less lag. So, um, I'm going to be providing you guys with this link in the description. Go ahead and click it, and then click to this page. And I'm also going to be providing you with the link on where to get your custom ROMs. And I'll have a follow-up video of how to actually install one if anybody's having any problem or anything. But let's first work on flashing the device. Um, before you guys do anything, um, flashing your device does void your warranty. So if you have a uh, warranty uh, with T-Mobile, it does void it. So, I mean, there's ways to re restore to stock, but... I don't know if they can figure it out yet, but I, I heard that they can't, so I'm just that I just letting you guys know it does void your warranty, so just be very careful. Um, go ahead and click on the link, and then what we're going to do is make sure you have 50% battery life, guys. Make sure you have at least 50%. Anything higher, no problem. Alright, what you're going to do is while you're here, you're just going to scroll down, and you're going to click on right here, the download the package. Oops, I'm not even logged in. I'm going to log in really quick. Give me one second. Okay, it's going to go ahead and download. I actually have it already saved to my desktop. So, there it is right there. What you want to do is, from here, go ahead and create a new folder and title it whatever you want. But just right click, go to new folder and title it whatever you want because you're going to be dragging that into it. Alright. Yes. Alright, so after you do that, what you want to do is go ahead and drag it into it. Open up that new folder. And you want to go ahead and right click and extract files here. And it should give you a little program like this. And what you want to do is go ahead and run it. And you go ahead and exit that out. Make sure your phone is plugged in. Yes, you need your phone to be plugged in. And what you want to do is just press next. Can ask you to um to allow it. Go ahead and allow it. Yes. All right. And if you come over here into my actual HD2, this is what you should look like. This is what it should be doing. Don't worry. It's fine. Don't go crazy. It's going to be fine. Don't worry. All right. And come back over to the computer. It's going to ask you what you want to do. You want to, right now I'm on 2.8 because I'm actually on the HSPL. If you see right here, this is my version. You guys will be on this one right here. So what you want to do is make sure you click the HPSL. Make sure you're converting it to this one. Don't get off of the 0000. zero, zero, zero. Go to the HPSL. And then press next. Run it. Successfully done. Yours is actually going to say loading... And it's going to actually, since mine is already on, or jailbroken already, or unlocked, or whatever you would say, yours will just go through a process, it'll feed it 100%, and after it's 100%, it's going to say, we hacked it. All you got to do is just then press next, and you'll be good, done. So you don't have to worry about that. And then your device is actually going to start up again. Well, it should, I mean, this is my energy ROM. This is an example of one of the ROMs that, I'm, that, that you guys can get. And let it, let it do its loading. Loading its sense right now. But this is just one of the examples of what you guys can get. Alright, you can see the back the backboard. I mean, you have some icons down here now. You actually have a Facebook tab. One second. You have a Facebook a Facebook tab. That's pretty cool. I just so. I mean, again, there's a lot when you also get Cookies Home tab pre-installed with the 16 dock icons. And that's just letting me know that I have no internet because I don't have a SIM card in this one. But I mean, nice and smooth, very nice and fast. A lot of the bugs and glitches worked out. You get you got a call history here and a calendar. The call history you log right into it and it tells you your past calls. Again, this is the phone that I use for messing around with. So, go ahead and just follow the steps, and I'm, I couldn't walk you through the HSPL, but all you got to do is just keep pressing next, 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 
and then it's basically you're done. So make sure you guys follow my steps. Any questions, please let me know. It's your boy Big Boy Bob 111. Peace.